stores resist against the current flow and convert the energy into heat. Ouch! A capacitor stores energy in form of electric fields between electric charges and can later release them when a load is connected between <coughs> Inductors store energy in the form of magnetic fields. Oh sh**. And yeah, I guess every wire has a resistance too. As you know, a speaker is a magnet and a coil that when you excite the coil with an AC voltage, it vibrates at the same frequency. <coughs> and that's why they say a capacitor blocks DC but an inductor blocks AC. Let me demonstrate. If I plug it into the pump, is there actually a voltage? I make this simple circuit and I'll plug it in. Now the circuit is hot and the voltage is on the Now I have replaced the capacitor on my circuit and I'll plug it in. Now I enable the power supply. and we can easily connect them together then we unscrew the outlet and pull it out I totally burned my finger okay finally let's power it up as I mentioned in my other video a power supply like this one that can generate 70 amps doesn't necessarily hurt you at all if the voltage is set very low observe no! I'll set this to 25 volts and increase the frequency all the way to 60 volts. I shock my ass sitting on these live wires. Always clean up the lab, otherwise something will bite you in the ass. Ow, it vibrates! Whoosh. When I plug it in, it should turn or vibrate. Now if I connect the circuits together... Wow! The series... Ow! Okay, ready? Ah, but in factories for high. Ah, if I measure the voltage at the output. Holy f The capacitor. Ah, f Piece of sh See if they look as we expect. We just have to tie the neutral wires to the ground of the. Here, I. I killed it. Don't short Of course a brushless AC motor like this one that I took from an old microwave oven can last much longer than a brush this <laughs> Phases come to some plugs like this one that we can measure. Here we have Burn my skin. Let's see what kind of pulses we should be making. Oh, Hello? Ah. Wow! We're back in my old video. The arcs can jump one <laughs> have a 10 microfarad capacitor. Watch the current carefully as I connect the capacitor. <laughs> Had these for over two years. Ow! Ow! it on the breadboard. Let's power it up. I created a light bulb. Obviously there's a wrong connection. I want something square and small. Don't seem they have it. Ooh, these metal doors are perfect. If I can find one without the handle. The relay can turn on a light too. Well, let's power it with 12 volt DC. I know the theory behind... 